Ladies and gentlemen, Fernando here. I continuously see the numbers climb on this channel and it's been phenomenal to see. If you're brand new to my channel, welcome. Like, subscribe and watch all the other videos. It's, we're gonna continue to be persistent and continuously create some more content. And so let's get started. We'll begin with this idea, this datum, and see if this is true or not for your life. That everything you do reflects your belief system. Everything you do in life, whether it's your business, whether it's your relationships, whether it's the way you carry yourself, the way you dress, the way you go about life, is a mere reflection of your belief system. Now you have to ask yourself, through what foundation am I operating under? Through what beliefs am I taking initiative on? And you have to see two sides of the pendulum. Am I operating my life through the frame of mind on an empowered state of mind or a disempowered state of mind? Now you must see the fucking roots of your life and how you compose and carry yourself. That whether you begin a new business, what frame of mind, what ideas are going to be the foundation of this new creation? And what seeds am I going to implement to continuously sprout and get the results that I want? You see, take a look at your life and analyze. Everything you have on the outside is a mere reflection of the inside. Now, do you approve of the environments you've created? Do you approve of the physiology of your body, your communication, your state of mind? Or have these all been triggered from outside environments, outside influences that saturate your mind? Now you have to ask yourself, what standpoint and through what system, what beliefs do I operate under? That whether I'm brand new to an industry or experienced, that I can perceive from a empowered state of mind that I am a true practitioner of my art. I'm a practitioner of my life. That I aim to be the master of the masters. That everything I do comes from the standpoint that I'm setting the fucking tone on a consistent basis instead of an eroding mindset that diminishes your self-will and your self-perception of you. Now you must be hypercritical and see and analyze who's feeding the negative belief systems. Are there any outside influences that create this negative pattern that continue to take you away from where it is you desire to be? Because ultimately it's gonna fall down to you. You must take responsibility for the ideas that you take in for the way you act upon in life and the way you go about it. It's not about anybody on the outside. It's about you and your perception. That no matter what conditions you can find yourself in, that you still have an empowered state of mind to create and find the solution to each problem that encumbrances your life. You're not happy with your health. You're not content with your business. Your relationships are continuing to suffer. At what standpoint will you shift the perception into an empowered state of mind? And so we need to now bring an awareness and analyze where our belief system is at. And if we need constant improvement, which we all should aim for, to seek out better ideas based on the way someone is succeeding in life, their representation of the manifestations they created. If I want to be successful, I must analyze to see what a successful person or beingness through consistent action, I must analyze how they operate and their state of mind. So I get that perception. And now I can conduct myself from that, that point of view. But if you're continuously in a negative environment and you never see new realities outside of yours, you continuously bound yourself into that, into that friction, into that shortcoming, into that negative belief system. Now you must look into your life. Are the people that you receive information from qualified assets to give you that information? 
Now, have an awareness to this as your environments are constant influences of you. And everything you do must come from the perception of an empowered state of mind. That life is a practice and every day it's getting better and better. Every day I'm getting better at my business. Every day I'm getting better at my health and I'm constantly seeing and tracking progression. Not in this delusional state of mind, but in an action proven and consistent state of mind. And so these are something, something that you can immediately integrate and begin to think of and operate. And this is where a lot of studying and self-development, but this is the inner workings of life. The roots create the fruits. The seed in your mind must constantly be watered and worked on. And it's a practice of life that everything you do, it's a, it's a committed standpoint that you're here to learn the power and the art form of everything that you take upon because your life is your story and how you, tar how you tell your story is his story. And so we must continuously be masters at our craft. And so that's it for this message. If you have any, any mortgage questions, send me a message, find me down below, reach out to my social medias and let's connect, man. Everybody, see you in the next one.